When buying a man's suit, there are a few details you can see on the outside to determine if it's a good quality. But as NBC 12's Diva of Discounts found out, you have to really tear a suit apart and look on the inside to find out what makes a decent suit. When you buy a suit, you want to get one that's going to last. So I took it to Franco so we could tear it apart to show you what to look for. Franco Ambrosi began sewing at five years old. After 61 years of tailoring, he knows what makes a quality suit. There are differences that you can see. What is in the sleeve, what is in the collar, the bottom of the sleeve, the bottom of the coat, it's all done very finely by hand. But it's what you can't see that makes one suit better than another. This is all done by machine. There's no one, there's not a single stitch done by hand in this coat. This coat has fusing to help the fabric hang better. Uh, they just bought tack, just a little place on, on each seam. It saves a lot of time because the machine is bam, 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 and that's it. The canvas on a nice coat goes all the way to the bottom to stabilize the front of the garment. This one stops far short. The lapel on the finer suit was done by a blind stitch machine. The lapel will always roll nicely over here. It's just been fused, has no canvas, or really has no balance whatsoever. Franco has rescued machine-stitched suits that come back from the dry cleaner misshaped. This one is fully canvassed it's from top to bottom. The chance of, uh, of bunching up is almost zero. A high-quality suit would have four different stitches around the sleeve, the canvas, the sleeve head, and the lining. If I rip this, the whole sleeve is going to come out. One machine stitch holds the whole coat together. If the lining is loose, it's been put together with one stitch. When it comes to the trousers, look at the waistband and the trimming. The machine sew it up in such a way, eventually it's going to fall apart. Also has no body to it at all. Look for pants made with snug tack. It keeps the waistline from rolling. I'm Jennifer Warnick, NBC 12 News. Thanks, Jennifer.